smash the like button. Do you want to set up the battle for us, like the battle lines, or do you want to like um, talk about yeah. like the arrangement on the field? Okay. Um, as far as I recall, um, uh, Hannibal set up his troops. He had his uh, Hispanics and Gaul Gallic troops in the middle. And, Infantry. Uh, in the center, in the uh, in the van, and they were in a crescent form. Okay, now on on the um, so a crescent form, but like uh, the point at the the top of the crescent being towards the Romans, right? Right, exactly. And on the left and the right, he had um, African uh, on the flanks. He had his African uh, mercenaries mm -hmm. and, and Hispanics. Uh, well, no, the Hispanics were in the middle, but the African mercenaries, the Numidians, etc., were on the the flanks. And then beyond that, he had his um, his horse, his cavalry were divided into two. One was led by um, Hasdrubal, and the other one was led by Maharbal. And um, they were, you know, the ones responsible for, you know, completing the double envelopment, you know, they kind of went around, um, out outflanked the Romans and eventually trapped the entire Roman um, cavalry. Now the Romans, um, uh, the, the uh, battle uh, was um, this, to go to battle that day was decided by uh, Varro because Varro was in charge for that day because the Romans um, alternated uh, authority. Okay. And- um, but We should say that this was like the largest army that the Romans had fielded to this date. Is that correct? It, it was uh, around um, 80,000. So, so normally a Roman army would be about 40,000. It would be- Well, see the, the Roman legion was about 5,000. Usually less because it's you know had some attrition here and there. Right. And um, the Romans normally fielded about um, yeah uh, eight or ten legions in the field, um, but with the um, and then they would have allied legions that would be like, right with each legion the same there, size. Would be, there would be an auxiliary uh, Latin or other you know. Um, Italian legion. Gotcha. Anyway, um, but they had assembled some 80,000 uh, uh, men for this. And um, Varro uh, arranged them according to first the skirmishers, which were called Velites. And, you know, they did some light skirmishing. And then the uh, maniples consisted of um, uh, Hastati, which Hastati literally means spear, Hasta means spear, and then uh, Principes, which were the were older and more experienced uh, legions, and behind them the Triarii. Now, what, what Varro did was he kind of compacted the legions to kind of form a um, a, a spear to try to penetrate the um, uh, Gallic and, um, and Hispanian uh, center. So 